How's it going everybody? It's Solaris100 again with another video about uh, useless stuff which is kind of awesome. So um, I just received another present to myself from myself and uh, it took around three months to arrive because when that item um, went live on the website it was sold out straight away and I was just very very lucky that my order just went through and they told me sorry man it's all gone but we're gonna get a restock and then we're gonna deliver your item so that just happened item got delivered and uh, let's have a look what's in the box so exciting Ta -da! yep my friends it's it calls Dissected Companion. And if you are collecting vinyl toys, you know that this is a pretty awesome item. Um, yep, yeah, there you go. It is the Black Dissected version, or as they call it now, the Flayed Open Edition version. So, what does that mean, my dear geeks? Um, this is not one of the original pieces that he, uh, he released a couple of years ago. Um, this is the smaller version and the less rare version, the so-called open edition, which just got released with Medicom. Do I need to talk more about Kors? I'm not quite sure. That guy is so big at the moment, it's crazy. Uh, he did a collaboration with Uniqlo. Uh, he's exhibiting all over the world. Um, you know, he's uh, releasing so many collaborations. Uh, there's just a new Jordan coming out. There's cause mania going on. I like bold colors, I like pop culture, and cause he's just the man when it comes to that. Um, he was one of the first to really kick off that urban vinyl trend. He did one of the first uh, toys in Japan, which was basically this character, the companion. And uh, yeah, he went from strength to strength. Uh, he's part of the upper echelon of a uh, cool dude, so to speak. Uh, I'm not saying he's overrated, I'm just saying there's so much hype about that guy. I love him, I mean, I was even featured in a documentary about his exhibition in, uh, in England. But uh, it's just like, I really love that guy, I admire his artwork, but you know, it's so much hype. It's crazy, like everything is instantly sold out. So I was really happy uh, when, the, when these pieces came out. That was the colorway I, I, I was wanted for years. And it's just a great second chance offer. So I went for it and you know the hunt and the excitement and now it got delivered. Let's open it up. So uh, let's get a... Ooh. It's always, you know, as a collector you always have that issue. You want to display it and you don't want to ruin the, the packaging. I mean if we just have a look at the packaging, it's see-through, but it has this silver drawing of the character on it. Um, you got all the medicom, whoa, all the medicom information on the back. There you see already uh, his signature on the on the feet. Apart from that, you know the original pieces came came in sturdy cardboard boxes with a drawing on it. So this time they're going for this kind of see-through situation. Personally, um, well, it's nice, but I would prefer a proper, a proper box with some nice artwork on it. So I don't feel too sad that I'm opening this one up. Opening it at the bottom. Whew. Still pretty excited, I must say. Although it's a less rare open edition, still really exciting. Mm, let's get this bad boy out. It's just a really well made toy. Let's get it there. Go. Oh, interesting. Okay. So, let's get it out the box. There are a lot of toy artists doing dissected figures now. For me, the dissected cause companion still reigns supreme. And uh, yeah, the colors are great. There's a little bit down here. Now that's going to be interesting if that's a flaw of that's meant to be. So I need to do some extra research if this is a feature or a, 
or an issue. Okay, so what can I say? Here's still some uh, some wrap so that the arms are not rubbing against the body and tarnish it. Let's see. Whoop, there we go. Arm wrapped in all its glory. There you go. The coarse suede companion. Now you have this really nice day glow skeleton with all the intestines. And I'm really loving this color scheme. It's just really great. Loving the pink brain. Loving the pink brain. It's just awesome. As you can see, there's some kind of uh, muscle detailing here. The head has no articulation. You can move the arms. You can move the hands. You know, that's basically cause demanding my money for the toy. And I'm happy to give it to him. And uh, yeah, you can move the feet. You got Medicom and the core signature in the feet. And it says, of course, open edition. So, you know, you can't rip anybody off of eBay going like, hey man, this is the original piece. Give me a gazillion dollars for it. And it's uh, very well sculpted. And um, it's awesome. So there you go. I'm happy. I'm still kind of keen on the brown original one. Um, but so far so good. That was my favorite piece of that toy drop. I'm happy to have it. Oop. They should look this direction. And uh, yeah, I'm happy to have it. And the uh, course is awesome. And I'm really looking forward to all the cool stuff he's gonna release in the future as well. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, let me know if you bought this toy as well. If you know about course, um, I'm putting a link in the description to my blog where, where I wrote a little bit about course as well. And uh, yeah. Till next time, when I'm talking about stuff, which is kind of awesome, but nobody really needs. Bye.